was weird. It turned around the other way, but I didn't do it myself. It kind of did it by itself. I didn't do it manually. Okay. Anyway, so I want to talk about House of Fluff. So this is that community idea that I have spoke about in a couple of other videos and live streams, whereby it's a community for people who are different, who like to dress different and act different, like whether it be a dog, a child, or gothy, mocene, furries, theorians, and pups, and everything else. And it's a community where people can either visit or live in, or just chat online, because it's going to start out as an online chat community thing, like YouTube or whatever other like communities you can think of, um, that people can decide. But, yeah. So I just want to let you guys know that it's a community whereby everybody can just feel free to be themselves and dress however they want to. And they don't have to worry about prying and judgmental eyes on them when they go out and about and stuff. Because you can expect everyone will be dressing differently and they will be expecting you to dress differently. If not just accept it, they expect it even. So yeah, so I just want to let you know that for this community, of course, if it's going to be one house... We are going to need a few different people that can do, like, skills for all this community. So one of them is obviously cooking. Right now, in my house that I live in now, with my mother, unfortunately, I have to do all the cooking. And if I don't do it, or do it wrong in some way, she will shout at me. So it's like, it's kind of messing up with my autonomy a little bit, because I would rather be doing stuff like this or doing my creative stuff, rather than cooking. So I just want to make sure that in this community we will have someone to cook if it's a house or if it's like several houses of people living in. Then, I don't know, they can do their own thing. But it would be nice that I could live with someone who could cook stuff for me or if I don't live with them, they could just like make me food and bring it because I don't want like takeaways or like crap food, you know, like um, processed food. I want to make sure everything is fresh, freshly cooked and homemade because I'm trying to be more healthy and I don't just don't like to cook so I want to make sure that when I live on my own finally especially in this community that I will have someone who who's willing to provide me with meals if not live with me and be my cook but just someone who can cook well and hopefully vegetarian because I got quite jealous like there is this uh there's literally an Instagram profile I think it's Instagram yeah it is it it's called meals my boyfriend cooks for me or something I thought this girl is so lucky because she's got this boyfriend who cooks for her every single night. And it's always this dead gorgeous, gourmet, healthy, but very nice food. And I thought, that's like, that's my freaking dream. Is for someone else to be cooking for me every night so I don't have to think about this stuff. Because I just don't have the brain for this. I get distracted easily and I'd rather just not be doing it. I can focus on stuff I actually like doing. And even then, like, just barely focus, so... I need someone to help me with that. I need a freaking assistant. So I need someone who cook me nice meals and, you know, like give me, either deliver them to me or just like live with me and do it. And then um, just to, assistance to do other things as well, just to help me out. Not technically do everything for me, but just to help me out. So that's what we could, we did need into it. Uh, that's what we need in this house of fluff thing. This lovely community. So that's the name of it so far, unless you can think of a different one. Everyone liked House of Fluff, so that's why we went with that one. But yeah, Out of the Wild. Uh, I will think of a name, an alternative name. And don't forget, we're doing furry meets and Ethereum pack as well for people to join. So yeah, that we need people to join those as well. So it would just be like a monthly or regular meet up for furries and theorians and, and whoever else wants to join goths and emos and scenes and stuff like that people like those because it would be nice i would really love to have a group of friends who were goths or emos or whatever because i've never had that so all the friends i've ever had have, have just been normies and i've never had like a group where we all dress similar and i've always like fancied the idea of that it could be all victorian like a, a gang of people who dress as victorian that would also be cool so anyway, I guess that's all for now. That's all what I wanted to say. But please do consider joining. We'll have a big online community as well as a real life one where we meet up regularly and also one where we li actually live in an area. So yeah. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and your ideas as well. Comment your ideas, your opinions, your thoughts. 
Okay, I guess that's all for now. Goodbye for now.